So people uh, with low libido, you have to think of several things. If it's if you used to have a high sex drive and then suddenly you have low libido and it's it's happened quite um, it never happens overnight, but it feels like it's happened overnight or very quite quickly. You've got to think of getting some medical tests because it could be a testosterone problem. You could, sometimes testosterone level can drop. And, uh, and, then, and then it could be because of the, you know, several things. So it's best to just get a medical, um, a medical test for that. If uh, it's happened over time, it could be like as, look, as in a long decrease of libido over time, it could just be age because as we age, sometimes we can lose our libido. We're not, you know, usually somebody in their 40s or 50s that are not feeling as horny as people in their 20s. So it could be that. Sometimes low libido could be indicating that you are in a long-term relationship and that is actually also very normal. When you are with the same person for all the time for many years and there's no more surprises about that new person because you know so much about that person and, um, and you're having sex with that person the same way for so many times, um, libido can decrease over time. And the one way to kind of uh, change that is by checking if you can just put some newness into your relationships. Sometimes maybe trying, trying new things with your partner that you haven't tried before or that you haven't tried for a long time. And then your libido might just resurface because the erotic lacks newness. So, uh, so that can be a, a, another way. Um, but also low libido can be uh, a symptom of, of uh, other medical issues, maybe not testosterone specific, but other issues. So it's always good. It's always a good idea to uh, get medical tests anyway. If you have always felt you had low libido from the very time, you know, as an adolescent, when you started to become sexually active and you noticed that you were a lot less sexual than your peers and, and, uh, and your libido has always been low. It might just be that it is part of your sexual orientation. That's nothing to do with anything wrong or anything bad. You can still get the medical test anyway, but people have different baselines of, of sexual arousal and not everybody have a strong, strong sexual desire.